Hi, my name is Yashar and I'm a 28-year-old industrial engineer from Azerbaijan, currently working in Dubai, United Arab Emirates. I'm recording this video as a part of my application to the master's program in supply chain management at MIT. In this video, I'm going to answer three questions. Firstly, why would I like to get into this program and um, what in my background prepares me for it? Secondly, what is the perfect job that I would like to get after graduating this program? And thirdly, what the supply chain problem I find the most interesting and why? So to start with, I would like to talk to you about my background. In 2007, I got admitted to the industrial engineering program in um, Middle East Technical University. And um, my journey started at that time. So it's now 12 years that I'm within this field, either in the academic world or in the professional world. Then in 2013, I went for a, for a master's degree in industrial management. So I had an industrial engineering degree and I wanted to, to uh, complement it with the management side. So I studied um, industrial management also. Now I would like to be more specific by, into, by studying in this program. And then I, I did this MicroMasters credential in supply chain management. I finished it uh, uh, two years ago. And then uh, I have uh, more than four years of work experience in this field, either in the warehouse management or in production management and uh, in, um, in production planning. And I have done uh, several courses like Lean Six Sigma Greenbelt certification. And I, I worked on inventory optimization for my company, which actually yielded good, uh, good results. And um, we are currently located in Jebel Ali Free Zone in Dubai. And every day I see this process uh, by my own eyes. We have a port, there are ships, containers arriving, they are offloaded, and they are delivered to customers. And all this process, it's amazing how they are orchestrated. And it draws my attention a lot. And by studying in this program, I would like to know more details about this process and I actually want to become an expert in this. And regarding the long-term goals, by studying in this program, as you know, MIT is a brand. Actually, it's more than a brand and it's a way of thinking. It's a way of doing the job. So to boost my career, I really need this degree. And secondly, uh, what... Uh, job I would like to get after after graduating from this program. I would like to talk a little bit about this. So the dream job me, for me now is uh, becoming a supply chain manager of a, of a company. And in my current company, they differentiate between um, operations and supply chain. They're actually two different departments. Me as a production planner, I'm under operations team. So um, by studying in this program, I would like to uh, widen my knowledge, uh, to deepen my knowledge in supply chain management. And eventually, after coming back, I would like to get into supply chain department and then become a supply chain manager. I would like to lead a team of uh, demand planners, supply planners, customer service, and warehouse. These are the four different teams that are under, under a supply chain manager. Uh, management now in my current company. And finally, um, what global supply chain problem I find the most interesting and why? I have stated this in my um, application also, in my thesis proposal. For me, reverse supply chains are, are very interesting because they have not got the attention that they deserve. In, in forward supply chains, uh, we have these um, uh, the chain starting from the supplier and ending with the with the end customer, and this has been discussed a lot. There are a lot of models in the literature and uh, on the internet, but there are very few that discuss the reverse supply chains, which are actually very important. Um, so reverse supply chains include um, spare parts, services, refurbishment, recycling, and so on, which are becoming becoming uh, of paramount importance nowadays and since um, a lot of pollution is happening in the world is especially recycling and refurbishment is important and on the other hand if for example we don't find spare parts of a certain car brand 
uh, why would people purchase it? So I would like to specialize on this and do a research and, and uh, come up with meaningful conclusions. Thank you for considering my applications. Looking forward to meeting you. Thank you. Bye.